Justin's still asleep, so let's go to the roof. Now I need to come get you. I really hope the wind isn't too bad up here. Maybe I should scream. I think I just need to scream in general, you know? I've been having a really great time recently. I've been doing way better. Except for the fact that I can't sleep because your girl is still so stressed out you know I talk about it oh I'm living out of a suitcase right now the like extent of how hard that is today's May 5th yes today's May 5th happy Cinco de Mayo maybe I need to go down like 10 margaritas to forget my life I was supposed to move in by the end of March at that point that would have been like a three-month period freaking co-op is slow okay they're slow I had my final board interview in April all they have to do is take a week to prepare for some papers my banker and I are pissed try to pretend that everything's okay because how can you hate being here trust me I love being in the city in college I never felt at home home's not a place sorry I'm so aggressive right now I I just have so much pent up inside of me because I'm awake until 4 in the morning or 6 in the morning every single day and Justin can vouch for me because this bitch doesn't sleep either. He goes, you should probably get that checked out. Girl, I can't get that checked out. I can't. We were supposed to move in by the end of April. Then they were like, sorry, the attorney's going on vacation. We can't do anything. I'm holding on by a thread right now and you can't do anything sometimes i just need a rant the only time wait what was i oh the only time i can fully 100 percent be myself is when i'm alone that's why in college it was also really hard for me and here it's been hard for me i've really been here for five months with no home isn't that kind of lit guys can you tell i'm like losing my sanity i was only supposed to be at their place for a little bit of time and i hate upsetting people i just hate doing it i feel so bad i don't even know if any of this is gonna make the video we we're supposed to close tomorrow. I was supposed to move in tomorrow. And they emailed me this morning saying, actually, we're going to close on the 12th, which I know is not that far later. It's just so upsetting. I don't realize how much it's like taking a toll on me. Seriously. This is really therapeutic though. I'm not going to lie. With all the stress, especially in the winter, I was binging so much. Felt like it would only stop once I moved in and that just get pushed and pushed and pushed. I haven't binged though. Hey, in like a couple weeks, my body's gonna wanna be where it wants to be at. Maybe I won't be a 15 year old body. Oh, that's not a 15 year old body. 15 year old body my entire life. That's okay. I grew titties and that's okay. <laughs> I've been going to Equinox every single day. Every single day I don't go to Equinox, it's $10 out the window. But you know, for me today, I think I need to just appreciate life, <laughs> the city and the beautiful. What day is it? Thursday, that it is. <sighs> that was so good. I'm graying so bad. I've been sick too from the past month and a half. I think it might be stress. Yeah, you can definitely hear it when I was screaming. to make them fall. They always find a way. Quick outfit of the day. This top. <sighs> I think it's from like Kind Candy LA. I wish I could check the tag, but unfortunately I'm not in the mood to retie it up. Look how cute the back is. We got this skirt. My ass looks so fat. Hey, fire. This is from Lululemon. Get this guys for the shoes. I'm a little cowgirl. <laughs> Oh, that was so cringy. <laughs> On the corner of Thompson and Houston, which one of you guys goes, Is that really how you pronounce Houston? We're not in f***ing Texas. It's not Houston, okay? Sorry. I called it Houston, though, for like the first two weeks. Whole bunch of cool stuff all the time there. I want to go buy stuff for my house when I move in. But, like, we shouldn't plan to advance, because, like, what if I end up moving in 2023? We'd never know. This is just me making fun of my pain. Paul and I are like homies. For you, 35. So now I have these. <laughs> Am I flashing anything right now? I put a poll on my Instagram. If you guys don't follow my Instagram, y'all are fake. I would appreciate it right now. What the f was I talking about? Sorry, I've been cussing a lot recently. Something in me is telling me to just let it all out. So I'm going to listen to that voice in my head. But look at how long my hair has grown. 
Damn, okay, Shari. Look at how long it has become. Love it low-key, because I love putting it in a ponytail. I would never have enough hair for it. Should we just go ponytail today, or is it too ugly? Side note, the whole month of April, I could not take a single photo of myself. That's why I, like, barely uploaded. First, I felt, like, sad, you know? I'm sad again. Yeah, we get it, Vanessa. <laughs> What's new? When you lose yourself, and you're on the internet, I don't want people to mistake that for me, because that's not me. See what I mean? My titties grew. Like, this is me, <laughs> okay? Okay, maybe that was too much. Editing would be torture, because I'm watching myself for, like, hours hours and I'm picking myself apart. I think when I'm going through things, I'm still figuring it out and I could give some ass advice and I would never want to do you guys like that. Let's put on makeup. I haven't worn makeup in a while. Did I wake you up? Yeah, especially when Chris was here, I would just be in the living room. I slept on couches, yo. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that couch is not as uncomfortable as some of the ones I've slept on. But you're more than welcome to stay. I'll be a little quieter. Penis! That's Justin, everybody. I FaceTimed Paige the other day, and I just caught her up on my light, and she was like, Dude, everything's like finally going well for you. Yeah, I'm so happy. I feel like after like the past five months of hell, I will keep those it a little bit. Look at my under eye bags. That one is more prominent than that one. Wow, am I gonna cover up? No. I don't like contouring because contouring makes me break out. Where's the Justin doesn't even drink, so it's okay. We know he's joking. That's it. That's my whole makeup routine because everything, as you guys saw, is in my travel size bag. So yeah. Guys, complete. That means I can talk louder. So I went to the sunglasses press thing. It was beautiful. They took a picture of my eyeball, okay? If you look at my eyeball, it just looks like you're staring into the depths of a person whose soul has been gone. But that's my eyeball. Can you believe this is my eyeball? And they gave me little flowers, which I put up. I'm trying to make a home in the one week I'm here. See, I put my flowers in a little makeshift vase. Then we got my books, my journal. I journaled hella yesterday. I knew something was coming. My intuition. It's always wrong, but not last night. They gave me these glasses. Look at how swag. You know what? You've had enough of me talk. You want to see the city, right? Okay. I need to go out anyways. Snow assistant today. <laughs> the benefits are terrible. Whoa. I'm making $2 an hour. Fuck this. Fuck my life. Ooh, yeah. Okay. So here's my vision. Come up here. Now there's unsafe working conditions. Yeah, I'm a little bit like... She doesn't define working hours either. I'm not getting overtime. Oh. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't. When does my life end? Never. Hopefully I like one. <laughs> I got 200. Get off there as soon as you can. I just feel like actually scares the shit out of me. That, and that is how we take Instagram photos. Oh, if you can hear this, send help. I am being held hostage. She is literally putting me to work for hours and... No, no, no. Don't do this to me again. If anyone's in need of a fight choreo. It looks kind of dumb without anybody else there. Justin, you do it all the time. Just like, oh. it's always there. the sound there. too. Parkour. Sorry, people below me, that was a loud jump. I'm just gonna get changed and we can go. He just spent 10 minutes watching TikToks or what was that? Star Wars clips? It's Young Justice. It's yes. a great cartoon. Really good and was really great for adults too, as well Regular as Regular show. But I liked Pops. Pops was so funny. <laughs> you know who is likes Pops? Hi, Mom! He likes to do impressions all the time. You know that's his hinge thing? He does an impression of what? Kermit the Frog? No, I changed that. <laughs> Aren't these boots so loud? I posted a TikTok like Google is my one and only true love. You know it's been my longest relationship. We've never gotten in a fight. We do long distance now. You're in a long distance relationship with blue balls. <laughs> and then he just laughs at himself. It's funny. Is it Justin? Is it really? Oh shit, it's still recording. <laughs> Whenever I come home from college crying in tears, blue bowl. They don't have one in New York City. One of you guys told me to go try pliables, and I made Justin come with me. He's unbiased. We're going round two. Let's go. Bruh. Justin's oh, really upgrading. Pretty. It's not like you just took the photos. Uh, Do you want pictures? Seriously? I never asked, so rude of me. <laughs> Look at the spring flowers. Justin, how dare you just walk past? When you go on a walk with me, we take a couple of random stops. Oh, look at that pink house. Isn't that pretty? It's so pretty. Kelly! Hey. What up? Uh, yo, yo, uh, ice cream man. Want some? What do you got? Well, well, well. Looks like you guys came to the right place. <laughs> step right up, step right up, step right up. What's your favorite flavor? Vanilla's great. I got plenty of vanilla. I have to put my gloves on. What's your uh, health instruction rating? It doesn't matter, man. These are actually used gloves. Budget cuts. <laughs> Reusable. Reuse, reduce. Reuse, reduce, recycle. Want mix in? Still. I'll literally just get rid of it. A little boring. <laughs> What's the name of your shop? Step back. Right. I'm showing it to you. Oh god, this is really sick. It's getting sick. Huh. Oh, <laughs> gotta be good for that. Needs to mix a little bit. Here we go. Oh yeah, now we're mixing with each other. Oh, 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 gotta be quick. Let's go. This is not good. Alright, here we go. 
one. Oh my god! I don't know what's happening. This has never happened to me. <laughs> this is my first day on the job. My boss is gonna kill me. At this point, if your boss doesn't fire you, I'm a little bit worried. <laughs> this for Justin to also get some extra ice cream. <laughs> How does it taste? It tastes like Safeways. Good luck with the rest of your business. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye cool. Bye, now we finally get our pliables. <laughs> In the corner of Washington Square Park. Hi, Theo. Where's Ruben? I thought he'd be here to help you out. Help you, Sophia. Good. Hi. He makes the same shit every day. I can recite it right same. now. Toast, and you have jam, and then you have scrambled eggs and an avocado. I have yogurt in there sometimes. I don't blame you. I do the same thing every day. We're at Washington Square Park. If this is just as good as Blue Bowl, today would have single handedly been the best day of my life since I've been in the city, minus the fact that my housing got moved. I think you're gonna be disappointed no matter what because you're setting the expectation way too high. Okay, well, yeah, true. How's yours? It's solid. Have it's a dripping. I haven't had Blue balls. Sure, Justin. Texture doesn't even compare. It's so drippy. Actually, this part's a little thicker. It's not the same, but it's good. Oh, f my blueberries. I think this is a symbolism for what I'm going through in life right now. It's not always going to turn out the way you expected or the way you had hoped, but in the moment, it's still good. It's a fucking acai bowl. You know what they say? It's not the same as it was. That's so insightful. It must have been for milk and honey. I haven't had an acai bowl in my <coughs> Oh, not acai bowl. <coughs> Bless you. <coughs> Whenever you sneeze it, there's like a saga. God. Dustin, what's it like living with a girl? Pretty normal. Just like another third roommate. If you want my actual thoughts on that, I like <laughs> kidding. What's the nicest thing anyone has ever said to you? I treat everybody, whether I just met them or they're like my best friend, the same way. What's mine? Thanks what's for up? asking, Justin. No, yeah. What are you? So, <laughs> mine was when Gabby told me all my friends went out and I wasn't there. Your presence was so missed that something was oh. gone. Something nice that I'll say about you is, like, you know how people, they code switch super instantaneously once that camera's off, but like, no, Vanessa's pretty much the same. Like, she's just as nice, she's just as chaotic, she's just as, <laughs> you're not putting on a facade for anybody. In Vanessa. one word, how would you describe New York? I don't know, I don't, in one word. Spontaneous? So many opportunities for human interaction. How would you describe it? Alive. A lot, yeah. No, that's better. The lighting is so bad here though. I just sat. I wanted to lean against that tree right there and I put my ass in the dirt. Haha, <laughs> what a fucking idiot. People watching so fun, especially in New York. You literally see every single person imaginable all in one space. I have been listening to this song so much. Someone else's heaven. There's this one lyric, your hell is someone else's heaven. Thinking about the past five months I've gone through, that is still someone else's heaven. I'm still so grateful to be here. I'm so grateful. I have people who gave me a place to stay, to have what I have, you know? I cried to this song a while ago. Even in the worst of the times when you think life sucks, that is someone else's heaven. And it's a great song. You guys gotta listen to it. Now I'm just sad at the park. I get to not be in college right now. And that in itself is so many people's heaven. I get to be in New York. That again, so many people's heaven. So many people's heaven. Something grammatically is wrong right now, but I just got the text from my realtor. It's officially one week from today. It's been confirmed. No more of that bullshit. That's something to be happy about. Just turn my music up. <laughs> oh, well, say hi. Hi, how are you? Hi, I'm good. How are you? Okay, <laughs> let's get the chocachino with all the Bar. I come here all the time. At home, I'd always get these chocachinos. It's just mushroom coffee. The guy inside, I've seen him every time I've come here. I was in the bathroom and I walk outside and he hands me this. He goes, Here you go, beautiful. I was like, oh, You just made my day. Like her put just hello. This is like a prime people watching spot. I'm not gonna. <laughs> What's your name? Hope. Nice to meet you. I'm Vanessa. How are you? I'm good. How are you? <laughs> are you a YouTuber? Yeah. You're hustling the poor guy. It's, it's been a second good. since I've played chess. 20? Yeah. I just want to go for 50. 50? I'm not that good. <laughs> smart. Am I? I can barely understand you. Oh, you know how to play. I feel so under pressure. I've never played with time before. I'm putting you under pressure. What are you doing, girl? <laughs> I'm so confused about when I have to press this thing. I feel like this has got to be a setup. Do I want to take your setup? Can't trick her. No, she's hard to trick. 
You didn't expect it, did you? That's what people tell me. They don't expect anything I do, and that's why I'm not bad at it. Right, right. <laughs> you must be a winner. You got guys outside, they want to help you now. Okay. Damn it! You do concerts. He's checking me. She doesn't say that. Oh, check. I didn't realize it was already a check. You forgot to hit the clock. Okay, yeah, I don't know when to hit it. After you move. Oh, Oh, now she want to hit the clock. I forgot. She's defending everything, girlfriend. Defend me. I don't know. Nobody helped this young lady? I don't think that was a big deal. Who wants a nice kid like you? I would have placed like this. It's like chess. That's it, I hit him. I, got, I <laughs> forgot what I was going to do. Surprise. Check. Checkmate. Did I hit him with the checkmate? All the young boys would be like, yo, bro, she's a doll. You got to do her that way. She's a doll. Man, how does that happen? Who earned it? Have fun? Oh, yeah, I love chess. <laughs> Play her another game. This time I got to be more tricky, though. Yeah. Are you copying? I'm trying. Oh, that would have been stupid. I'm a little stressed now. You have been nice. I feel like you want me to do that. Well, if you take that. If I'm going to do it anyways. Ignorance is bliss. That is me. You must have been excited to play chess this way. Well, I was really excited. <laughs> Thank you. Yo, she's smooth, though. You got to be careful with her. Can you get this lady to do what I want her to do? Going against the policy. Going against the grain. I don't feed them. She loves all the things I love. Can you believe it? Doggies, babies, sacrifices. Checkmate. Is that checkmate? Oh, no. Check that out. 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 Everybody, so don't feel bad. But you, I try. You survived that long. We need the best chess player to come to Union Square. Line him up. Line him up. Yo, wifey. <laughs> He's a great chess player. <laughs>still reminds me so much of you and I know my dad misses me a lot. I'm 3% Taiwanese, 3% Japanese. A lot of you guys ask that. My mom's Taiwanese, my dad's Japanese. My dad loves these. I miss my dad. He also loves these and these. My dad's house is always the one packed with snacks and then when you go to my mom's house, bruh, there's nothing. Those are so good. It's not dope. My shoes. Should I get a face mask? Because why not? I like the ones that peel off. It's like when you get a sunburn and then you peel off your sunburn. It's low-key satisfying. Oh, no way. These ones that make you look like Squidward milk. I don't know if I should put milk on my face if I can't even put it inside my body. Thank you. I have 5% on my camera and I'm also sitting on the steps of some random building right now. It's 4.37. I'm hungry, so we're gonna eat. I got the face mask, but then I also got this. I think it's red bean. Looked at the ingredients and it said it had red bean. So we're just gonna hope. <laughs> so fluffy. I'm pretty sure it's right there. It's more like a paste though. This is just a mukbang. <laughs> It's been so fire. I'm watching people. I don't know if that's glue or if that's paint, but they're rubbing it all over their legs. It's so cool. It's not out of pocket. It's just New York. I'm moving in a week. I could cry because I'd waited so long for that. Well, anyways, how's your days going? How's your life going? Talk to me in the comments. In the past five months, I was never alone. How do you guys? So thank you for putting up with me. You're probably like, girl, she even buy a house. I would probably be like, she's lying, she's capping. Of 1%. <laughs> are so cute when I move in I'm definitely coming back I was wanting to buy some more flowers today something like that these are both pretty I picked these ones eight dollars thank you so much I'm adding these to my flower collection later best customer oh I love doll. I bought a jacket oh from him. God. I got these boots. Now he's got new clothes. Houston Street, Sullivan and Thompson, <laughs> Soho Flea Market. Yes. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. You should look at all the merchandise. Vendors from it. everywhere. Africa, Nepal, India, Peru. This girl is so sweet. Aww. She's great. Hi.
I love Paul. If you come by, say hi. Say you found him for me, okay? That's right. He gets a discount every time. I want that painting. Wow. Oh, beautiful. I definitely want that in my house. I love the frame too. When you're gonna buy it, I'll hold it for you. Thank you. It's a cast iron. My roommate could use that. Hit him with it. You wanna take it? No, it's okay. I have sure? enough dresses right now. He will be loved. That purse is so pretty. Oh my gosh. No brand. How much is this one? 15. This is my favorite you store. Flowers. Myself. You, you gotta treat jealous. yourself. This matches my outfit so well. I'm buying it. I'm sold. Thank you. <laughs> been a long day and I did not expect today to go this way at all. First, <laughs> I used to be obsessed with Cheerios. In eighth grade, I'm not even kidding, I'd bring a box with me to school and just like give them out. So then I rediscovered them recently and these are gas. And I bought this purse for $15. I'm having such a great time living here. I love living here so much. And now that final walkthroughs on Tuesday, my move in is in exactly a week. We're it's feeling a lot better. A lot of the times I focused on a lot of things that I couldn't control and that would stress me out. And now I just realized some things I shouldn't put my energy into. No matter how much energy I put into this, if nothing's gonna change, why waste my energy there? When I could be putting my energy into something else, I love filming. What New York City is really like, you know? It's not always fancy dinners in Soho. It's not always like drinks on rooftop bars. Sometimes it is, I'm not gonna lie. Sometimes it is. Realistically, that's not my life. My life's made of moments like playing chess at the park, being nice to everybody, because every Everybody belongs in this city. Nobody belongs here more than the next person, you know? Anyways, I have a lot planned now that I'm in a better headspace. So I really hope you guys like this video. If you did, make sure to like. If you really like me, don't forget to subscribe, comment anything you want down below, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, broskies. Now I'm running with new brownies, let's sing. I got copyrighted, so enjoy this outro for now.